Buzz, good evening. How are you? Good day, good morning, whenever you get to see this. Thank you all for subscribing. Really, really, really been appreciating the love so far. And if you're watching this and you haven't subscribed as yet, please do. Give a sister your support. Okay, this evening, today, I want to talk about wraps, head scarves. My sister inspired me to do this video because she watched my last video. She's living in Germany. She showed her friend my video and the friend wanted to know how I did the scarf, the wrap. And I said, it wasn't any big deal. She said, no, it's a big deal because she doesn't know how to do it. So you should do a video like that. So I said, okay, I'm going to. So I did this one. I'm going to pull it out right now and I'm gonna show you how I did it, really. So, okay, this is really a body, body wrap. Because I wasn't going to use my hair as the support, I used another scarf and I placed it on the top of my head. Hold up. <laughs> okay. I'm going to be probably looking clumsy because I'm no expert. However. Oh my God. Don't embarrass me. Okay. Anyways, yeah, set. So, this is a body wrap that I used because it's big. So, what I did was fold it. Fold it. And I brought... Up here, yeah. You don't want to make it too tight, but you don't want to make it too loose either. So I push this because it's so big. I put that underneath. You could use a smaller wrap. Just do your own judgment and. So, you're going to want to I don't know this done exactly like how it was done but you could do it whatever way you like it's not hard really it all depends on how you want it to look. However, I think it's something near to what I did. Let me take a look. Oh, it's different. I mean, every time you tie it, it might end up different. Anyways, I don't want to take up too much of you, your time. So, I'm going to try to do the others real quick. <laughs> oh my god, this is all right, we finished with that one. So, there is a, like this one is very, it's not big. So, what you can do is just tie it to the back. And you twist make a twist you could make one twist or you could just twist it like you twist your hair and and 
This is the one she saw on my head. Voila! <laughs> Let me see how it's done. Okay. So. Okay, this one I'm going to take the tie or the knot, the knot to the front. Like I said, you don't want to do it too tight, but you don't want to do it too loose either because the firmer you do it is the more support you have. You don't have to use any pin or anything like that, but you could use a pin if you want to. Because this one has a fancy stuff on it. Voila! <laughs> so, it's just up to you to fix it the way you want to. And then, this final one I have is also pretty simple. And like I said, the firmer you tie it is the better you get the support you don't have to use anything additional so. yeah I know I've been posting about here lately but Give me some time to do a little adventure here and there and do other stuff. Remember, the channel is Journey with Sass. It's not all about hair. It's not all about going out. You'll see a little bit of everything as time progresses. I hope you're enjoying my videos. And subscribe if you haven't already. And thank you to all my supporters and my subscribers. I really, really, really appreciate it. So... Have a good day, have a good night, and thank you for watching. And remember, click that subscribe button. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Thank you.